Right, so in this video, we'll be looking at N3 electrical trade theory. And we're going to take a look at a past question to uh, prepare us for the national exam paper. And this question has got to do with the module on domestic appliances. Now, this question reads as follows. The procedure below was followed during the replacement of a heating element, the immersion type. Rearrange the steps by writing only the letters in the correct order in your answer book. Now, before we look at re the replacement of an immersion type water heater, it's just a few uh, guidelines we need to know from SANS 10142. First of all, the uh, circuit breaker for the geyser inside the distribution box will be rated and it will be labeled for a geyser. For a single phase circuit, there will be a live coming in and a neutral going out. And then we will have an isolator within hand's reach of the geyser. Now, according to SANS 10142, the first rule that we're going to be looking at is that there must be an isolator within one meter of hand's reach of the heater. The hot and cold water pipes must also be bonded for earthing reasons. Now, for a single phase geyser, the live wire is brown. Pre 2004, it was red. The neutral wire is blue and pre-2004 it was black and the earth wire is green and yellow. For a sub-circuit geyser, the circuit breaker, depending on the kilowatt rating of the geyser, it is usually rated at 20 amps and the conductor size of 2.5 millimeters square for the cross-sectional area. So let's go ahead and look at the steps of replacing a heating element. First of all, we should isolate the geyser from the supply and make sure that the circuit breaker is off and the isolator is switched off. Close the mains water supply to make sure that we don't waste any water. Open the hot water tap and drain the hot water from the geyser. Disconnect and remove the element. Replace the with a new element and gasket. And restore the main water supply once you've fitted the element. And once you've restored the water supply, you can go ahead and restore the main electrical supply. All right, that's just the basic question for domestic appliances for N3 electrical trade theory.